Noob Noob, I heard you love Ray from Star Wars. I, <laughs> I, lo I love her so much. <laughs> you just love her so much. Her tiny white titties. You're going to make love to her. I will. So this is the least serious Star Wars podcast you're ever going to watch. And the most white. If you have a Star Wars fan and a, a barely a Star Wars fan. I saw some episodes. I prefer when Daisy Ridley is a corpse. That's my favorite part. I like her when she, instead of Daisy Ridley, she's Gazy Ridley. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Just like the famous rapper. With uh, She, she should have been gay with that one in episode eight. Who was that? The Asian. Uh-huh. The Lulu Lemon or something. <laughs> what? Ellie Wong. Uh-huh. Well, we're... Steven Yun. <laughs> we're going to talk about what is happening. I have some beef with this. Star Wars celebrations. Yep. We're going to take a look. What do you think of Daisy Ridley dressed like that? I, I'm immediately unhard. <laughs> Are, do you think that she belongs in Harry Potter? She belongs in a box. Does she look like Hermione? She looks like a Hermione. <laughs> Hermione. Hermanfrodite. Well, Ray's return and a tired Mandalorian season riled up the fandom at Star Wars Celebration. Are you riled up? I. You're railed up. I would get railed. Not want to be rayed up. No, but there's four days of Star Wars Celebration. That's t there's not enough Star Wars for that. There is not. Yeah. Apparently it was in East London and the Star Wars community was well represented with people of all ages and ethnicities cosplaying as their favorite characters. You know, Wookiees. Maybe some... Uh, C-3PO's. Some R2-D2's. Jar Jar Binks. They were binking it up. Yep. Apparently... Sometimes fandoms can be good without the racist backlash. You know, because Wookiees, you could be racist against Wookiees. I love it when they're not racist. You could be racist against uh, Greedos, whatever that race Racism is called. Racism is the devil. Do you know what a Greedo is? I know what a Guido is. What about Jabba the Hutt? What Italians. is he? Italians. He is fat. And furious? He's fat. He is very fat and furious. And a oh, you said he's fat. I thought you said he was fast. No, he's You're not fast. Slurring your words there. Yup. <laughs> Daddy's tired and had one too many kamikazes. Oh my gosh! <laughs> you go, you go, dry, flying down the kamikaze yep. highway. Well, we heard a story that's pretty exciting. Is it? I mean, we need more from Ray's story because we you don't. know the that that trilogy, you know. Started off making a billion dollars and then was like, we're going to make less than a billion dollars. You know, the rise of Skywalker, which nobody really seems to like. They're going to double down it on it. It was Ray. better than Last Jedi. Was it, though? I mean, people are doubling down. It didn't make more money than Last Jedi. So they're going to double down on the Ray. They're going to do double the Ray. Are you saying you liked Rian Johnson's Last Jedi better? Loved it. More Every than second. the Rise of Skywalker. They're both. First of all, you know my hatred of J.J. Abrams. And on top of that, but Rian Johnson though. Who do I hate more, Rian Johnson or or? Tough question. That is a really tough. Question. Tough question. I think I hate J.J. more Oof. than I hate because he did two of them, which were terrible. Because I was one of the few people that when we when you watched the force awakens or whatever nonsense that was called i was like that was garbage and just trash no and other was, people were like i love it and i'm like no jj it was literally just episode four redone yeah no yeah episode four yes yeah, yeah, yeah. he's a clown jj abrams is a clown it's a requel yes he's a chode and uh now mandalorian season three is not doing so well and they announced all this stuff Apparently, Rey is supposed to rebuild the Jedi Council. Or, like, she's going to make a Jedi Temple. You know, stealing that book called Jedi Academy from the extended universe. They're just going to steal it and give it to Rey instead of Luke Skywalker. How do you feel about Rey building a Jedi Academy where she has no books, no holotapes, and was never trained? 
she needs to build a whorehouse <laughs> where she offers her services to any man, woman, or Jar Jar Binksian that will take it. Well, that's a good point because apparently there are rumors that she is prego in the new series. I hope First not. of all, I don't know that this movie's ever going to get made, it's but I'd not. like to speculate. First of all, who are the prime culprits? I don't think it's Ben Solo because he dies. And not before she's, forcing his seed in her. But <laughs> did she wait like 10? Apparently, this takes place 10 or 15 years. She after. forced withheld the baby. So she withheld the baby. All of it's because of the force. She force aborted those babies until they were ready to be force born. Force delayed the babies. Okay, not aborted. We don't yeah. talk about that here. Nope. They were in stasis. Yes. What about the idea that they're Jar Jar Binks's babies? Yeah, I like that better. So they would be Binks's. They would be little Binks. Are they twins? Probably, because she's a forced dyad. I hope so. Forced dyads are a thing, right? I don't know what that is. Well, if you read Heir to the Empire... Is it Heir to the Empire? It's a good question. But Leia has twins. she got twins! But they deleted all that, so they're just going to give it to Rey. So Rey might have twins. So... Oh, Jar Jar has twins with her. Super stupid. What if, and this is just a rumor, this is this is my my suspect, Baby Yoda. Because he's gonna be like 30 years older by the time he'll yeah, be like he's gonna be 70s. a man. He's not gonna be baby Yoda. He's gonna be man Daddy Yoda. Yoda. Daddy Yoda. And apparently he's gonna show up in this dumb show or movie. He should. It's the only way people will watch it. But what if he's not a baby anymore? He's Man Yoda. They want to see Man Yoda. Daddy Yoda. Daddy Yoda. I told you, Daddy Yoda takes takes charge. Force choking bitches left and right. Yeah, which we did have a T-shirt, which you could buy. You could force no choke longer. a bitch. Yeah, you can force choke a bitch. We would have got ten cents for it, and it would have been invested in Dogecoin and stolen from us. Yeah. So she has a yellow lightsaber at the end. What does that even mean? It means who are you? I don't. What? What? It what? means she peed herself. <laughs> I think, right? Yes. She's a forced dyad. Oh my gosh. Kylo Ren heals Rey with his hand over her womb. I, I don't know. This gif makes me think that he uh, forcefully inserted his hands in places he should That's not a have. Really, I didn't realize how stiff that acting job was. What was that? That was like, oh my God, where did you put your hands? That was like, oh my gosh, me too. Yeah, they should have made out immediately. They do. Do they? Yeah, they they kiss. kiss. Yeah, and then he dies. Oh. Oh. And then why does she take the name Skywalker? I don't know. There's twin sons at the end. She has twin sons. Oh, and then there's the whole baby Jesus thing. Where uh, Anakin's mom, Shmi Skywalker, she's baby Mary. No, she's the Virgin Mary. She is. She does not remember... Although I don't think Darth Vader is Jesus, so that seems kind of a bad idea. Amen. Yeah, Christian Bale was Jesus. Was he? No, I don't think. I don't Mel know. Gibson was Jesus. No, he was. Mary, Mary of Jesus in 1999, which starred Christian Bale, was Jesus. All right, then. Who else was Jesus? Henry Cavill? No. No. Uh, that guy who doesn't act all that much. Anymore. Jim Cavill. Jim Cavill, not he- Henry Cavill. Jim His Cabell. brother. Clearly, brothers. I made that up. We did. So anyway, uh, as far as this rambling, tell us what you think. Who's the baby daddy? Let us know down below. We love all y'all. Catch our live stream, 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on YouTube. Catch us on Rumble. Catch us all those places and more. Get us monetized to a thousand. Tell your friends, tell your family, tell your dogs, tell your tech, tell your cats, tell your family, hide your kids, hide your wife. We love all y'all, but we are on to the next one.